And in this week's video, we're looking at OneDrive again, and this time we're looking at how you can embed a presentation into a web page. So that web page could be on your website or it could be on your college or school VLE. So, first off, I tried this using my work account, and because your work account is, is part of Office 365 for Business, it won't let you. Um, view the presentation that you've embedded without having to sign in. It's part of the security settings that your organization set up. So in order for this to work you need to be using your own personal OneDrive and not your school or college OneDrive. Um, I'm happy to be proved wrong. Please put in the comments if you found a way of getting this to work without requiring a sign-in then I'd uh, be really interested to hear how you've achieved it. So I've got my own personal OneDrive account here I've created a presentation and there's two things, two ways I can do this. I can tick the presentation, so I've selected it there and up in this menu at the top I can click embed and it says as a warning anyone who visits this blog or web page with the embedded file will be able to view it without signing in. So it's warning you there, if you click generate it will generate you a embed code there so that's one way to do it and that's via OneDrive and just selecting the file and it'll give you a preview of that as well the other way is to open it and then the quickest and easiest way is just to search embed it will then bring up this window you can choose the size that you want to embed it at uh, and then simply just copy the code copy the code. So in this case I'm putting into a page on a Wix website but it could be your blog or VLE. So enter the code let me move that to one side and if I resize my my iframe box on my website you can see the presentation. Now the advantage of this is obviously from a student perspective, they're not having to go off and launch PowerPoint. They can view it there and then within the website or the VLE. Uh, it makes it nice and easy for them. that They don't have to have access to PowerPoint. They can view it there um, straight in front of them. So there you have it, two ways of very easily embed, getting an embed code for your PowerPoint presentation and adding it to a web page. Hope you found the video useful. Please join me again for more EdTech videos and remember to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.